Hi everybody, Laura back again. There's my fingers. Okay, I have been working on this baby jacket. There it is. It's the only picture in the Work Basket magazine. I have uh, the chain row, the first row, and then the second row you do a few times until you hit a certain amount of stitches, which I got. And then the third row, this one right here where these little guys are. Um, let's go back out so it's a little more seeable. These, so where these row stitches are, um, that one had to have a certain amount of repeats. Well, I ended up with one less, if I remember correctly, or one more. I'm not sure. I can't remember which direction it went. Okay. But anyway, I just solved it. I just fixed it. I just made the last one. Um, I mean, I still was off by one, but I stitches, you know, I just, okay. That's just the way it's going to be. So then round four, which is this round attached up here. doesn't give me an amount of, of that stitch. Okay. Then there's round um, so that's three, four, five. Okay, so round five. Got that one to work. I think I had to fudge it a little bit, though, for some reason. I don't remember what why I had to fudge it, but I think I had to fudge it a little bit to make it work. Okay, and then the next one would be round six, which is the ones where you've got the, what do they call them now? Uh, twin clusters. So these things are twin clusters. There's three in a twin a twin cluster. Okay. But there's two clusters next to each other, so that makes them a twin cluster, okay? Got that to work out just fine. Then I'm coming back across, and I'm doing basically doing these again, right? This is row seven, chain five, turn, single crochet in the next chain one. Chain five, single crochet in the first stitch of the chain three, which is, I have all that going up just fine. Um, chain five, single, uh, skip one, chain stitch, single crochet in the next chain stitch. Chain five, single crochet in the next chain one. Repeat from star four times. So I've already done it once, so I'm repeating it four more times. Then chain five and skip seven twin clusters. And now I think what's going on here is that we're starting the space for the sleeve. I finally figured that out. Um, but I think that's what's happening here. This is the front, obviously the opening. This is the back over here. So I think what this is doing is creating space for the sleeve. But this is the part I don't quite understand. Chain five, skip seven twin clusters. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's halfway. Or darn near halfway. Skip seven twin clusters. Now, mind you, I have a half of a twin cluster right here that didn't get anything. Okay, so now I'm skipping seven twin clusters. So I've got a half and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I'm supposed to take from that chain five and I'm supposed to single crochet in the first chain stitch of the next chain three over here. That seems like an awful lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven and a half. That seems like way too much for that that sleeve section to be created out of. 
but looking at this, I think that's what we're doing here. Uh, we're pulling it together to create the sleeve section. Okay, so I was going to ask you, uh, you know, if you could help me understand this. I'm still, I still need help. Um, if you can help me understand this, okay, I would really appreciate it. I really like this idea and I really wanted to create a, a baby jacket to have in case I ever have a grandchild. And yes, I know it's pink, but it's the only... It's the only yarn that I thought I would have enough of or not enough of, so to speak, because the rest I wanted to make blankets with. So, well, anyway, I think I understand this now. But if you've if you've ever done something like this and created a sleeve with skipping twin, seven twin clusters, please leave me some messages, some comments. Um, I really want to finish this one. Um, I think, though, I think I'm understanding it better now. So I'll give the rest of this row a try. And if I have to, I'll make another video and ask for more help. Okay, thanks for watching. Be safe. Bye-bye.